nothing against Islam, like you said. You know, you say he's great. You say he looks, you know, you say he looks unbeatable at times. But he hasn't really fought anybody. You know, that's that's really the truth. He beat number 14, and then he beat Dan Hooker, who was on a three or four fight lo losing streak. And now people will say, well, one of your wins was against Dan Hooker. So, you know, what are you talking about? I fought Dan Hooker at a, at a different time. He had just went 25 minutes with Dustin Poirier, who at that time was the number two lightweight on, on the entire planet, you know? Um, so I just think Islam, Islam's strengths are also Charles' strengths, and Charles' striking is better, and I do think, I don't know, I just think, I think Charles is more skilled, you know? I think uh, if, if Islam can go out there and he, is, and he actually is that strong, he actually is that dominant with position, then, uh, you know, Charles is going to have a long night, but I think Charles is just too slick, too good, and uh, he's going to give him fits on the feet. Can we get some predictions for fellow Brazilian Charles Oliveira and Islam? Charles Oliveira is an amazing fighter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And nobody can talk about him because the kid doing something very crazy. You know, and training hard. Can yeah. you predict a win for him, or are you taking Islam, or? Of course, it's a tries big the fight. Bronx go win, bro. Of course, <laughs> the Bronx go You think he's got it? it? 